You may have seen expensive running bore ranges where the cardboard cutout travels at the wild bore top speed of 25 miles per hour, almost as if it is on rails. It is on rails. Well, my neighbours and I decide that we can beat that, and at a fraction of the cost. So that's a wheelbarrow um, tyre cut in half and then folded down. Hopefully the rope will go around it. It all came together back in the heady days of summer when we were allowed to gather together like this. The washing machine engine belt turns the wheelbarrow wheel which moves the rope which pulls the trolley with the cutout bore on it. So we go round. Oh, Edmund. Hand on that Edmund. Well. Right, if you unravel it before he takes my hand off. My friend Fish, former tank commander, is sharpening his office serial skills on getting local sons and daughters to set up a running wild boar. We will come back to that word running later. Right, so this goes round to the other pulley. Yeah, we get that. Yeah? In a circle. And then we're going to peg it to the ground. No, either end. Oh, okay. Yeah. So you need the pegs and mallet. Right. Now, for this outing, Fish is in charge of the design strategy. His son, Fred Fish, is more of a tactician. He built the kit, and he is already in trouble. I got the wrong size tent pegs for the problem. I, I blame the subcontractor purely. Yeah, he had the order just completely failed on you know, spec. Yeah, it's a technical difficulty, but. Big. We're going to overcome it by a big hammer. For the target, we were going to use Fish's cutout bore with its wrong way round tusks. Happily, the gun trade rides to the rescue. New German thermal optics manufacturer Liemke has been sending out these bright orange cardboard bores, and we have nicked one for track and trace purposes. There is also the matter of the rope. As you can see, it is not spooling cleanly. I mean, genius doesn't run easily, does it? No, no, it's it's... I've seen monkeys working out problems, and this is quite... Fish is a hard man to please. After much toing and froing, and occasional breaks for other kinds of target practice, we are ready to shoot. Is the boar ready to be shot? Now it's time to fire him up. And that is where we hit our first major design flaw. Yep, the belt on the washing machine engine is slipping. Monkeys, Fish. Monkeys. Happily, he has a solution, a winch. Attach the winch to the bore trolley and behold, the world's slowest running bore range. Nothing daunts a British officer. Back to the drawing board, men. <laughs>